That's great. That's just fucking great, man. Now what the fuck are we supposed to do? We're some real pretty shit now, Welcome man. To fix Let's Play team. Uh, we are sorry that uh, we've been uh, treating our program like crap. And you might be wondering, hey, look at Vic. He's, uh, he, what does he have in his hands? He's got an alien's colonial marines. Wow, and this game should have been so epic. And Gearbox, Gearbox just fucked it up. Just like that. The reason why I bought this, and I even bought this on, uh, and uh, they say they don't give you the DVD, but they give you this t-shirt, which actually is pretty cool with an uh, alien on it, a glow-in-the-dark alien. This, uh, here, let me show you. Yeah. Let me show you the t-shirt. See? It's pretty damn cool, isn't it? But the game is not like the t-shirt, right? Don't uh, like uh, the saying goes, don't uh, judge uh, the a book by its just by its covers. You have to read it, you know, you have to the game is so laggy, the game is so buggy, it's horrible. It's like a nightmare. It doesn't look anything like the demo. I'm sure all you guys have heard many, many reviews, reviews on this crappy game. I'm sorry if I'm stumbling on my words, but it's my very first review. And I just have to bring this to the people because I'm a, I'm a major fan of this movie series. How could they fuck it up so much? This is bullshit. Why? Then they even pay, want uh, us to pay for it, you know? Very much it's... Well, you can already see how much it is. So yeah, without further ado, I made this clip of what I think of Randy Pitchford and his uh, vision of aliens, colonial marines. He, from what I've heard and read on the internet, uh, it's not even true. Many companies have been brought uh, to this game, to work on this game, and then they were scratched and made to from the beginning. For example, the characters in this game don't have a real... They're not even cool when, you, when they die. You don't feel nothing for them. They don't have character. They lack character. This game lacks lacks a lot of uh, screenplay, a lot of... Uh, it's just a whole pile of horseshit, that's what I can say. You know, and it's it, it's just so buggy, you know, it's incredibly buggy, the story is bad. Uh, it's just a corridor shooter. It's mm -hmm. just like that, a corridor shooter. You go with your pulse rifle, oh, aliens! The, but another, another thing I want to mention, is that the motion tracker on that thing? You get up the motion tracker and put it back down, right? To see if there are, there are any aliens in the area, any hostiles. And uh, then what happens? You go into an area which you already know there are going to be aliens there, and then the radar goes off. What the fuck is up with that? The radar goes off. I mean, what's the point in making a fuck a radar in the fucking video game and there is no point to it when the radar just goes off? Yeah, it's useless. So, yeah, it's... Just useless. It's mind-blowing. It's like Prometheus. I right? don't, don't even get into that movie. Please. I've watched it and it's not pleasant. Bad acting. Bad uh, screenwriting. I don't know what the fuck happened. Like in Alien, right? I dare don't even know what Ridley Scott thought when he made Prometheus. What the fuck was he thinking? Was he on drugs? Seriously. He made such an excellent, legendary movie. I love this movie. I, I just love it. Yeah. Uh, so uh, he made this after that James Cameron's Aliens. The badass, kick-ass Huds, you got Ripley, Newt, Hudson, uh, Vasquez, the badass with the, that uh, big gun, you know that big gun, that smart gun, oh, that, uh, that you only use six minutes in the fucking game, six bloody minutes, what the hell, and the power loader, you only use it once, yes, once. You can say goodbye to the flamethrower that you saw in the introduction video 
in the game. Fuck that. Another thing I forgot to mention about this bloody game, of course, the DLC. And guess what? You, uh, the only thing good you get about the DLC is uh, Ripley's uh, amazing and legendary uh, flamethrower, you know? Uh, that's all the thing you get, and so a couple of upgrades on the multiplayer uh, weapons. But uh, in any case, you only get the DLC on the launch day of the game. This is so full of fucking crap. You only get the DLC, the first DLC, I heard there are supposed to be three or four more upcoming. I hope to God that at least the DLC is made for single player and they somehow somewhat save it, but I, that's never gonna happen, I know. Then you weren't even playing it real time on Xbox 360. So yeah, they just shit on this game, a big pile of horseshit that stinks, I can smell it through here. So yeah, no, this game overall is a pile of horse shit. So conclusion? So conclusion is a piece of crap. Gearbox can go and suck my cock. You know they can suck my cock through a straw. They destroyed this game, they mashed it into bits, you know, when I smashed, I fucking smashed it. The game in total has six hours. Uh, seven uh, max on hard, so it's a piece of shit because it's too short. The story has no meaning. I told you the characters look like plastic. And another thing, Gearbox had this game seven years in the making. What is up with that? And they we, they come up with this shit, you know, the, a game that looks like a, a GameCube. It looks like game uh, GameCube game. The resolution is bad. There is screen tearing. Oh, dear Lord. This ain't happening, man. This can't be happening, man. This ain't happening. And another thing, what I forgot about to say about this video, horrible video game, if you can call it a fucking video game. Because it's boring as hell. I wish I kill me or something instead of playing this crap. <laughs> Poor. Poor game, you know. I knew the demo well. I knew the demo well. It, it, it was so epic, you know. It was so epic, and now it's forever gone. It's gone down the fucking toilet. You just flushed it. Why did you have to flush it? It's an alien, an alien, Randy Pitchford. He must die. He must die a horrible death. Or it's. The end of all humankind as we know it. I don't know, this, this shit ain't possible, man. Game over, man, game over! <sighs> Goodbye, cruel world! So, the conclusion is that aliens, crony marines suck. You shouldn't buy this. If you buy this, you are wasting your life. And I already mentioned that. So just don't do it, you know, it's good for your health. You know, you don't try to buy something that is not worth your hard-earned money on this piece of trash, okay? I just said it. Thank you guys for watching. I, I don't know, I would rather play the lamest ass game that there is out there, the lamest 2D, 1D game that there is out there. Well, just not to play this shit. They had the idea already there, you know, ah, we're smart, we're gonna trick you. We're gonna, we're gonna uh, get a, we're gonna put open. a t-shirt on. We're gonna put a t-shirt on and dangle this dollar in front of you, you know? <laughs> yeah, you, you know, you can't get it, you can't get it, you know? You cannot get open. it. Oh. show us. The, show, to show you because I forgot. How could I forget? The biggest what? shock. The biggest shock, say, it doesn't come with a CD, but here it's a cool uh, t shirt, you know? They don't even know they're so. Uh, they should be ashamed of themselves. They don't even know how to treat their fans right, you know? And they throw in this 
t-shirt which is actually pretty cool but excluding the fact that there was no DVD in the case yes when people when you pre-order do not uh, whenever you enter a site do not get this version at least if you try to give yourself an idea of what the game is about of course I do not recommend it to the alien fans to the alien series like I am I would not recommend this game. If, if you are an Aliens fan and do play this game, I swear to God I'm gonna so fucking kill you. I mean, I don't know. Would you give this much money to this crap instead of bringing home food? Hard earned money. Our hard earned money goes to this piece of crap that I have in my hand and it's starting to smell. <laughs> uh, watch it, your... your uh... You're saying that you're poor, you know? <laughs> to the Dude, people. I am poor, but uh, I, I shouldn't waste my money on this crap. And I got yeah. this cheap, mind you. I got this cheap. I agree with you. For Only for the t-shirt. But that's the thing that bugged me, you know? That's what I wanted to say. The game is bullshit. Uh, Randy Pitchford just really raped it in the ass, you know? <laughs> I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna squeeze all the money out of it and all the fools that will play and watch this. Please watch a couple of, I made a couple of cutscenes uh, live on stage that uh, uh, Ripley was interviewing Randy Pitchford in the latest movie, I fucked up Aliens Colonial Marines, I'm such a clusterfuck, I'm a piece of garbage. And on a game when you are supposed to see aliens, and there are aliens everywhere, aliens, where are they? Where are they? They're coming from the ceiling, they're all over. And this crap doesn't give you that. Guess what? In the, uh, in the introduction, not the introduction, the training uh, part of the game, you only get a couple of uh, moments with the aliens, even if they're uh, buggy as hell. And uh, guess what? All, almost all through all of the game, you fight humans. Get that shit out of here. The only way to be sure that this monstrosity is never again seen, we must nuke it from orbit. You never take me alive, bitch for Kill. Ah, you piece of shit! Because you fight the corporation, you fight Wayland. Come on, I mean, get real. I mean, I know what they were trying to get with this, but it's just not working. When you are playing an Aliens game, I do not need Wayland Industries in this fucking game. Okay? So yeah, it's really fucked up. I recommend that you do not play it. You shouldn't play it. If you're an Aliens fan like I am, a true one, you shouldn't play this. You are just wasting your life and your money playing this crap. If you want to waste your life, I don't know, go get high on a joint or something, or get drunk or something, I don't know, but don't play this game, please. If you are a fan like I am, and you respect the Alien franchise as much as I do, I've been watching it since I was a kid. Oh, or better yet, Watch the actual Aliens movie, the first and the second one, and maybe the third one, the fourth one, Alien Resurrection, kind of sucked. With the old cloning Ripley and bullshit. If you haven't already watched it, shame on you. Uh, it's a very, very badass series of movies. You, you watch the Alien movies, then play this crap, okay? Don't do it. It's bad for your health. It's not good.